Coyotes are an apex predator in Kansas. As wild top dogs, they sometimes hunt in packs, but they are capable individual hunters too. They are usually nocturnal, but also move in daylight. They prey mostly on rabbits, squirrels, birds, and mice. But they kill and eat fawns or even larger deer on occasion. They commonly scavenge and eat even fruits and crops. Coyotes are smart and wary. I use various baits and motion sensor trail cameras to help watch wildlife interactions in the outdoors. This allows imagery one might never see or expect, like these coyotes eating corn. Raccoons are nocturnal omnivores that also visit a corn pile. They are predators too and fierce fighters, but they're normally smaller than coyotes. In general, the two animals tolerate each other in a sort of tense truce. Their contact may be casual, especially around a large food source. They usually go about their own business, the raccoons eating corn and the coyotes pursuing mice that also gather to eat the grain. But the coons don't take coyotes for granted since they can be dangerous enemies. Coyotes normally rule the roost and when they are aggressive, coons hit the trees for safety. Likewise, under various moods, raccoons sometimes stand their ground and discourage single coyotes. But in rare footage, here's what can happen when a coyote shows up. It's an outright attack where a coyote kills a smaller raccoon, not for food, but to remove a possible food competitor. Next morning, seeing this film, I returned to check the area and found the dead raccoon a hundred yards away in an open wheat field. It was simply killed from obvious bite marks, but it was not eaten. And this apparently wasn't the only time. Previously, I directly filmed a young raccoon eating in daytime with a badly hurt foot. Next day, I spotted the same youngster dead in almost the same location as this coyote kill, with buzzards cleaning it up. The coyote probably killed the hurt youngster that night in the same manner captured on camera. Such interactions occur in nature, but are rarely seen. This time, my trail camera told the story. I'm Mike Blair in the Kansas Outdoors.